Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x power 7 plus x power 5 plus x power 3 over x power 6 plus x power 5 plus x power 4 is equal to 81 over 27. To find the values of x from this equation. Now, from here in the numerator here, x power 3 is the smallest exponent. Now, this is common. So, we'll take x power 3 out of bracket. Then, x power 7 divided by x power 3, it is x power 4. Because 7 minus 3 is 4. Then, plus x power 5 divided by x power 3, it is x power 2. Then, plus x power 3 divided by x power 3, it is 1. Bracket. Then over into here in the denominator, x power 4 is the smallest. So this x power 4 is common. So we'll take x power 4 out of bracket. x power 6 divided by x power 4, it is x power 2. Because 6 minus 4 is 2. Then plus x power 5 divided by x power 4, it is x. Then plus x power 4 divided by x power 4, it is 1. Bracket is equal to from here, 81 divided by 27, it is 3. Then in the next step, we'll simplify here. x power 3 divided by x power 3, it is 1. x power 4 divided by x power 3, it is x. So from the numerator to be 1 times this inside the bracket, it will be this here, which is x power 4 plus x square plus 1 then over into the denominator to be x then bracket this here which is x square plus x plus 1 bracket is equal to this 3 then in the next step from here in the numerator which is x power 4 plus x square plus 1 to make want to make this in form of a perfect square so we'll add x square and minus x square then over this denominator which is x bracket x square plus x plus 1 bracket is equal to 3 then in the next step it will be this which is x power 4 plus x square plus x square is 2 x square then plus this here 1, then you can place here bracket this, then minus this, which is x square, then over the denominator, which is x bracket x square plus x plus 1 bracket is equal to this 3. Then in the next step, from here inside the bracket, this is the expansion of x square plus plus 1 bracket square then minus this x square then over here in the denominator which is x bracket x square plus x plus 1 bracket is equal to 3 then in the next step from here in the numerator is in the form of a perfect square whereas the perfect square rule is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket times bracket a minus b bracket. So from this rule, we'll apply this form here. Then from here, it will be a plus b. It is this x square plus 1 plus x. So here it will be x square plus 1 then plus x bracket then bracket a minus b, it will be x square plus 1 minus x. So here x square plus 1 minus x bracket. Then over the denominator to be x bracket x square plus x plus 1 bracket is equal to 3. Then in the next step, here we can simplify because here we have x square plus x plus 1. In the denominator, x square plus x plus 1. So this and this will cancel. 
So from the numerator, it will be this, which is x square, then x square minus x plus 1 minus x plus 1, then over this x is equal to 3. Then in the next step, from here we can cross multiply. So this 3 is same as 3 over 1, so we'll cross multiply. So it will be this times 1, here it will be x square minus x plus 1 is equal to x times 3 is 3x. Then we'll take this 3x to this side. So we start with this x square, then minus x. 3x we take to this side to be minus 3x, then plus this 1 is equal to 0. Then it will be x square minus x minus 3x is minus 4x, then plus 1 is equal to 0. Now from this quadratic equation, we'll solve it by using quadratic formula. So from quadratic formula, to find the values of x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. So it will be x is equal to negative b. b is negative 4. So here to be bracket negative 4 plus or minus square root of b square. It will be negative 4 bracket square. Then minus 4 times a, a is 1 times c is 1. So times 1 times 1. Then over 2 times a, a it is 1. Then it will be x is equal to negative and negative 4. It will be positive 4 plus or minus square root of negative 4 square. It is 16. Negative 4 times 1 times 1 is negative 4. Then over 2 times 1, it is 2. Then it will be x is equal to 4 plus or minus square root of 16 minus 4, it is 12. Then over 2. So it will be x is equal to 4 plus or minus square root of 12 is same as square root of 4 times 3. Then over 2. So it will be x is equal to 4 plus or minus square root of 4, it is 2, times this square root of 3. Then we divide by this 2 into this part and in this part. So here it will be over 2 and here over 2. So it will be x is equal to 4 divided by 2, it is 2, plus or minus this 2 and this 2 will cancel. So it will be plus or minus square root of 3. Therefore, into here we have two solutions of the values of x. 2, 2 plus square root of 3 and 2 minus square root of 3. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.